Hello, everybody. Let's get the exchange rate up there. Because today we're looking at a whole mess of PC Engine games here in Super Potato as we take a look at some, uh, yeah, Soldier Blade. Cool beans. Uh, as we start with a copy of Armed F for $29.48. And uh, as we're going to see looking at uh, PC Engine games, um, usually you're not going to find much under 20 bucks, at least. $23.98 for Sun Sun 2, which is pretty good as we can see some of the uh, labeling here, the condition of the hue card in the case. The case has a crack in it. Um, so at least they adjust prices accordingly, and they're honest and upfront about the condition of things. We got Don Dokodon, 27, 28, 30, 58 for Dragon Saber, which is pretty cool. And, hey, a rare occasion, 12, 98 for Fantasy Zone, which with the exchange rate right now, that's uh, maybe like a little under 12 bucks. That's probably closer to 11 bucks, actually. Uh, so not so bad. And here we have something... Um, well, I'm guessing this is something aftermarket, isn't it? A uh, little bit of the naughty stuff. Have fun with that. Uh, there are actually a handful of uh, PC Engine games like that where, you know, they can actually put digitized images in it. So there's uh, some naughtiness in there. What can you do? Salamander. 3828 for Salamander, which this is a fantastic uh, port of that game. Um more uh, accurate to the arcade game than its uh, NES and Famicom counterpart, for example. Um, Cyber Cross 2728, uh, from what I can remember, a side-scrolling beat-em-up uh, modeled after Super Sentai, aka Power Rangers. Uh, and here's something, you know, always a classic. Love uh, this port of Gradius 3718. Um, which, you know, it's it's a game that's not getting any cheaper, but I will say, if you like Gradius, the original on the NES, at least, um, you would really like the PC Engine port because it's fantastic. $12.98 for Galaga 88, another game that's uh, pretty cheap usually, and then $38.28 for Gunhead, uh, aka Blazing Lasers. Uh, which is just, uh, you know, an amazing shooter by Compile, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, you know, masters of these shoot 'em ups, though they are. Uh, we got some other stuff here. Where did we had some F1 things and blah blah blah. World Gambler AV Poker. Poker? Where? Um, that's what she said. Uh, yeah, so some more of that uh, uh, adult stuff. A little bit smutty, but I'm kind of a smutty person sometimes. Volfiv Adventure Island 2508. Pretty damn good game in its own right. Uh, some Shogi. Don't know what I'm doing when it comes to some Shogi. Sinbad. Don't think I've ever played Sinbad. Super Volleyball. All right. Of course, it can't hold a candle to Super Spike V-Ball, so don't even try. Why did anyone even keep making volleyball games after we already got Super Spike? Uh, Darius Plus 2728. Of course, anything with the name Darius in the title. Uh, is going to be some good stuff. Those are some classic shoot 'em ups. Very fun stuff. Uh, Hora Hora. Interesting little game there. Knight Rider Special 3278. My, uh, Michael Knight would be proud. I do believe. Uh, here we have some Niketsu uh, Soccer Hens. PC Soccer Hen. Uh, a PC Engine port of the sequel to Nintendo World Cup, so it's a uh, Kunio Kun River City Ransom soccer game on Hue Card. And there's one on CD as well, if I'm not mistaken. Rastan Saga 2, 2398. The original Rastan Saga, pretty awesome. Rastan Saga 2, not so much, unfortunately, which is surprising, because all you, you know, just make a game where you walk to the right and kill things. Here, one of the, the Golden Axe games for 1958. I think it's Makai Densetsu, so I think it's the original Golden Axe game, if I'm not mistaken, which I very well may be. Uh, Bomberman 93, 1298. So that's good. Another very, uh, very inexpensive game, if you want to add that to your PC Engine collection. No, no more than 12 bucks. And then for 1628, the original Bomberman. 
It's actually a little more expensive for the original Bomberman, but you know, you gotta love that uh, original cover. It's like a kid drew it with crayons. Very, uh, as they say, charming. This is where it gets a little tough to actually make a video like this, because we've got this tiny little aisle cramped, and I'm a, I'm a, I'm a generous 6'1", six 6'1 one, six one and a half maybe, and I gotta squat down, try to get some of this stuff. We've got Wizardry, we got the Cobra games, which there's Cobra 1 and Cobra 2. Was it Cobra 2 that was released internationally and just called Cobra? Uh, 1078 for Far East of Eden. Two Manjimaru, very popular, very big seller uh, at the time of its release. All of the uh, games in that series are fairly inexpensive. This pretty cool um, for 968, a factory sealed copy of Panic Bomber, and they had a bunch of copies. Panic Bomber, those are some fun puzzle games, and uh, the fact that you can buy them factory sealed for like nine bucks. That's pretty cool. And here we have, yeah, CD Soccer Hen. So this is uh, for 308 yen, mind you. Very cheap. This is the PC Engine CD port of what was called Nintendo World Cup in uh, North America, at least. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Fun game. Fun, fun stuff. Uh, and here we have a copy of Kabuki Din, which is 418 yen. So again, anything, in, uh, again, anything in the Tengai Makyo aka Far East of Eden series which you can check it out in a video uh, I recently did with Jimmy Hoppa and Happy Console Gamer uh, anything in that series is gonna be super affordable and here why the hell not for 528 yen some Sailor Moon action which unfortunately it's not a beat-em-up like those super super Famicom games I wish it was it's more of a visual novel kind of game as well as some Devil Hunter Yoko for 2398 and not too familiar with it. I'm more into the action titles. I don't like just to sit and watch my games. And what else we got? Oh, one of the uh, Dragon Slayer games, Legend of Heroes 2. Uh, also in the same series as, um, well, Xanadu, which uh, I covered again in that Jimmy Hoppa Happy Console Gamer crossover. Go check it out right now. The wife and kids will love it. Uh, anyway, that's about it for this video. Uh, PC Engine love. Can't get enough of it. So uh, thanks for watching, everyone, and take care. Soldier Blade. I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye.